so excited that you're all here. We have put on an amazing show, right? Am I right? How great was everyone? Yeah? Oh, yeah, they were awesome. They were awesome. But I am here to talk to you a little bit about library, right? So MicroStrategy Library is the focus of where our business users live. With the MicroStrategy One platform, we've advanced our technology across the entire product portfolio to elevate the data experience. And one of the products that we focused on in incredible detail was that of MicroStrategy Library, making sure that our users view content like never before. With MicroStrategy Library, we've built an immersive experience that our users rave about with an all new favorites display, content organization at both the admin and end user level, and content delivery options that put the end users in charge. MicroStrategy Library is at the core based on responsive design. With that, the library automatically adjusts content for perfect display across any device. This means that dossier pages and visualizations will rearrange themselves for web, desktop, or mobile. Content organization was built for governance and version control. Administrators can create one group, multiple groups, or set an entire dossier as the home page of an application like Morgan showed you earlier. This ensures that users have the critical and most essential content within the library experience at all times. These groups are locked in and cannot be deleted. And any user that's added to an existing group will view the content that's relevant to them. Now, that's not all. We've also enhanced other areas of library. When viewing content, users now get more out of the bookmarks experience. They can share and save specific data views at any time. Now, when they update a shared bookmark, recipients can view these changes as well, so much like a subscription model, to make sure that everyone is on the same page. One of the most exciting things we did in library was add, I'm not gonna do a drum roll, but let's get excited, editing. Editing in the library experience, enhancing convenience with a simple switch into edit mode. Content users can create new content or edit existing all within the same library framework. Dossiers and reports can be saved with new changes or new content can be created for ad hoc analysis or to be shared with the entire organization. It's one of my favorite features and you might agree with me, hopefully you do, looks a little bit better than uh, MicroStrategy Web, but that's just me. But it's super exciting. Now, at the core of all these library advancements, we were researching and thinking about how our business users make sense of all the incoming data. We know you're not just in MicroStrategy Library, you're everywhere. You're looking at emails, Slack messages, Teams messages, texts from friends. My team is always looking at help desk notifications. It's causing all of the noise and distraction that you see every day at full velocity. Our product teams wanted to cut the noise and distraction and enhance overall focus on key KPIs and metrics that matter. Introducing MicroStrategy Insights. Insights is one of the most exciting features that we've released in the past few years because of its simplicity. Insights allows users to select and track key KPIs across content. This means that a user might select different KPIs from across dossiers and bring them all together right in one view. All right, so what does it look like? From Library Home, the Insights tab will showcase the list of your set KPIs. Users have total flexibility to add or remove those KPIs at any time. Color indicators will tell you if metrics are too high or too low. And advanced charts and sidebar notifications 
monitor the activity of those KPIs over time, providing you more advanced analysis. It's like your own personal data assistant, all within the library framework. Now, let's look at an example, right? So this is one that we built related to World. You can see that we're looking at total visitors, top studio rides, shop sales, but Insights allows you to focus on these KPIs and these KPIs only. But we love Florida, we're here, but let's take a different example, right? So maybe we're a retailer with a large percentage of online sales. Insights allows you to detect maybe website traffic that decreases and allows you to take different strategies or maybe you pivot product promotion to avoid lost revenue. And that's just it, right? Insights allows you to identify issues or opportunities faster for more dynamic problem solving. It's key to improved productivity and it services data discoveries in real time. Now, the most impressive part of Insights, the impressive performance, right? So Insights is based on the semantic graph and it's supercharged by that semantic graph for more power, reliability, and security across applications. It is one of the most exciting features of MicroStrategy One, which is only available to customers on the managed cloud. You'll hear a little bit more about how we're advancing insights from Erica later today in a thing that we call futures, so hopefully you're all back for that. But one thing that we want to talk about now is embedding these experiences into where the users are, or into user applications, I should say. This is the key to analytics adoption. All of these products are fantastic, but meeting users where they are in a way that they understand, there's nothing like it. To tell you more, here's my friend, David Swan. <laughs>